Yep, recording. I tell Hansi people of Edinburgh team are very electric sheep because they still have no tram. Last Fräulein Hypnotik, we must take our sleep, take it up to Holyrood and construct this tram network this evening. Now, but how would it be? Let's go from Princess Street to Edinburgh Gateway. Paul Green, the Gal Centre, has he been the lady? Wave as we pass in the sun park alive. No need for cars by tram to glide. This is the newest kind of public transport. 30 minutes from the market to the airport. Take a flight to Frankfurt to Manzarati. All the sunny kids in the good city from Rocky. Ministers, let's get the tram project back on track or we'll take the hundred bucks and give us our money back. Every journey and adventure and so it's the only way to go. And it's fun, fun, fun on the Edinburgh tram, tram, tram. And it's fun, fun, fun. On the Edinburgh tram, 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 let's go from Trampy Place, it's ace, to Gorka Burn, it's burn. And it's fun, 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 on the Edinburgh tram, tram, tram. And it's fun, 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 on the Edinburgh tram, tram, tram. And it's fun, 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 on the Edinburgh tram, tram, tram. Let's go from Trampy Place, it's ace, to Gorka Burn, it's burn. And it's fun, 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 on the Edinburgh tram, tram, tram. Edinburgh tram. Hi, I'm Mr. Michelle from Waffle TV, and we're here today with Eccentronic music comedy duo from the show Neurovision. Brilliant. So, why did you choose to do a flashback? Well, we had this very successful song called Croydon Tram, and we described as Croydon's answer to Gangnam Style in the Croydon advertiser. So when we came to Edinburgh, we decided to rewrite the song because we were really upset to hear that still a year later, after we last came to Edinburgh, there's no tram. So we wanted to sort of create a utopia of an Edinburgh tram. Um, we know that people here are kind of a bit upset about the tram project. We wanted to bring a bit of excitement about the vision of where could you go on the tram. So we decided to do this flash mob in the style of craft work. Cool. So how do you guys feel about the tram? Oh, we love trams. We spend a lot of time, don't we, just travelling round and round. Mm. Uh, well, the, uh, I'm from, I live in Croydon in London, and my friend here is from Nottingham, and both cities that have tram networks that were not disruptive and were very efficient. Yeah. Uh, and so it is quite peculiar to discover so much hassle. And, uh, and it might seem that we're being facetious by doing such a silly thing about such a serious topic. But what but we're actually trying to, to do is be optimistic about the vision because you can absolutely take this tram. You can go to the airport for 30 minutes, which is brilliant. You can take a flight back to East Midlands, which is perfect for me. You can get back to Nottingham. Yeah. So, in concept, it's a great idea. Um, but it shows that in life, there's more to life than just having good ideas. You have to actually do yeah, them as well. So, is that what your show is all about? Well, our show is all about the dichotomy between the local and the global micro brand in Tusco homogenized state. Um, but it's also about writing an amazing hit song for Eurovision. So what we're trying to do is explore the different aspects of British life um, and how we uh, synchronise those into a one hit pop vignette, which would be a, a classic song for Eurovision 2019. And uh, we kind of go through a lot of different journeys on the way um, and explore different places in Britain, different British attitudes, including uh, Croydon and a song about our hometown. There's also the idea of the balance between being proud in where you're from and taking that too far, so it actually means you're reluctant to compromise. That's, that's a strong thing. So it's also a, a strong thing, it's about um, compromise. We've got lots of sequins, glitter, oh, yes. Always dodgy costumes, uh, and a big reveal. So <laughs> sometimes, it's bigger than, sometimes it's bigger than we anticipated. <laughs> I can't actually find my trousers after yeah, yesterday's show. A, it's going to be a pretty big reveal. <laughs> Tonight there's going to be a fairly big reveal, because I don't have currently any trousers to wear on stage. So with a bit of luck, they'll be buried under a seat at the venue or something. So we're showing, we're showing every night at the Fringe at 7.30, Maggie's Chamber, it's part of the free festival, completely free. Come along for a bit of fun, a bit of sequins and some singing along and dancing. Can I also say how grateful I am to Edinburgh for allowing the free fringe to happen there. It's, it's a great opportunity to come up with uh, and try and make people happy. Brilliant. Thank you very much for coming and speaking to us, guys. Thank you. have been watching Waffle TV. And it's fun, fun, fun on the Edinburgh tram, tram, tram. Let's go from Chandwick Place, it's ace, to Gonka Burn, it's fun. 
and it's fun, fun, fun on the Edinburgh tram, tram, tram. And it's fun, fun, fun on the Edinburgh tram, tram, tram. I'm not going to do a bit of a dance, but. Thank you. That's that's it for me. Great, thank you.